There were allegations of sex inside the Polk County Courthouse, but the person who made them now says she lied. As our Ryan Race reports, that woman is facing criminal charges tonight, and so is her boss, who's a judge. Two Polk County judges are now the ones facing the tough questions. The first, Judge Beth Harlan, arrested and charged for allowing her assistant, Alicia Rupp, to falsify her timesheets. The other, Judge Susan Flood, is accused of misconduct with her bailiff, but according to the state attorney, never broke the law. Judge Flood, are you having an emotional affair with your bailiff? I'm very attached to him. The state attorney's office opened up its investigation in July after Rupp, the judicial assistant fired for fudging her timesheet, came out with shocking allegations of sexual harassment and even abuse at the courthouse. It centered around Judge Flood and her bailiff, Bubba Maxey. Rupp has since told investigators she lied about most of her story, and on Friday, deputies arrested her. But in the process, state attorney Jerry Hill still found misconduct. I have kissed him not passionately or intimately. Have you ever kissed him on the lips? Yes. Judge Flood denied the claim of any sexual relationship with Maxie. This afternoon, our cameras were rolling in courtroom 4A where Judge Susan Flood was expected to take the bench, but at the last minute, another judge took over her docket for the day. The administration confirms that Judge Flood remains on the job just like normal. We'll pull a teacher out of a school at, at the hint of misconduct, but we'll leave a judge on the bench. The alleged misconduct doesn't end there. During the interview, the state attorney says they caught the judge on video looking at confidential documents while the others were on break. Hill wrote, all four individuals have brought shame to the circuit court for their conduct. Three of the four are still getting a paycheck. In Polk County, Ryan Raish, ABC Action News.